Anthropic just dropped Claude Sonnet 4, and people are already putting it to work. Zach Lee used it to make a 3D video explaining how black holes work, Testing Catalog News made a cyberpunk robot SVG, Bonit built a real-time 3D particle scene, and Nafis Amiri built an entire app in one go. So Claude Sonnet 4 is a pretty big leap from 3.7 Sonnet. It's faster, sharper, better at coding, reasoning, and follows your instructions more precisely. But how does Claude Sonnet it for compared to Gemini 2.5 Pro. Well, first let's look at a 3D mech inspired by Gundam. Claude Sonnet 4's version looks more realistic, follows the prompt better, and builds a stronger background, whereas the Gemini 2.5 Pro version is still solid, but not as polished. And then came a head-to-head -head on building an interactive app, and Claude made five working screens, but Gemini pulled ahead with cleaner navigation, better layout, and a more polished finish. And then finally, Merzen on X tested them with the same coding task. Claude Sonnet 4 responded in 20 seconds, whereas Gemini 2.5 Pro took 1 minute and 40 seconds. And Claude got straight to work with clean code, minimal fluff, just the right amount of comments. And Gemini, on the other hand, added long explanations, too many comments, and made the code harder to review. In the end, both worked, but Claude's output was tighter and easier to use. Gemini might still be better for long form planning or massive workflows, but if you're the one reading the output, then Claude is definitely the one that you want. Okay, so now for pricing. Claude Sonnet 4 starts at $3 per million input tokens and $15 out. Gemini 2.5 Pro is slightly cheaper on the input at $2.50 in, and it's the same $15 out. But let's be honest here, speed also matters. And so unless you're working with massive files or code bases that need the full 1 million token context window of Gemini, Claude's faster and sharper delivery is really hard to beat.